Hello and welcome to this dot trust video on solving problems where two fractions of the amount are taken when combined with some other fixed quantity. Let's read the question. When a bag is an eighteenth filled with flour, it weighs 139 grams. When the same bag is seven eighteenths filled with flour, it weighs 493 grams. What is the weight of the empty bag? Now the reason this is a slightly hard problem is because you've got the weight of the flour plus the weight of the empty bag and that just complicates it a bit. But let's think, when we go from an eighteenth field of the bag to seven eighteenths field of the bag, what's the difference in terms of the fraction of the bag filled with flour? Well we just need to subtract those. So if we do seven eighteenths minus that one eighteenth, that gives you 6 eighteenths, which, is, which simplifies to a third field. So that means when we go from eighteenth field to seven eighteenth field with flour, the bag is becoming a third more field. It's increasing by a third of the capacity of the bag. Now we can also find the difference between these two amounts because we're filling it from 139 grams of flour up to 493 grams of flour. So if we subtract those, so 493 minus 139, I'll do it in my calculator, that means we filled it up with 354 grams of flour. So if we fill the container by a third extra, and we filled it with 354 grams, that means a third, I'm going to actually change that to the maximum flour. So the maximum flour you could have if you completely filled the bag, that's 354 grams. Now we could at this point find the, the total amount of flour if the bag was fully filled. So the maximum amount of flour, if we times this by three, because we had a third filled, times that by three, so 354 times 3 is 1,062. So that's the amount of flour we would have if the bag was fully filled. Now we know that the empty bag plus an 18th of the bag filled with flour would weigh 139 grams. So let's find what an 18th of the flour. So an 18th of the flour, well we just need to divide that by 18. So we do 1,062 divided by 18. and that's 59 grams. And that means an 18th of the flour, which we know is 59 grams, plus the weight of the empty bag comes to 139 grams. So at that point, we just need to do 139 grams, subtract the amount of flour we have when it's 18th filled, so 59 grams, and that gives you 80 grams. So that's the weight of the empty bag, and that is the final answer.